for the Vodafone derby. They're off. They went without number three, first row, which leaves field of 13, headed by Hattan through the first furlong or so. Motivator adopts a handy position as the riders sort themselves out into a racing formation. Oratorio and Gypsy King are also well forward and Grand Central. Most of the Aidan O'Brien phalanx pretty well placed as they race through the first furlong. Climbing uphill, it's Atan who shows the way in the derby by half a length from Motivator. Gypsy King shares third place, racing on the inside of the pink jacket blue cap of Grand Central. And now Almighty scoots round the entire field. Having been last early, he raises the stakes and ensures, just as they were beginning to get a breather up front, that the pace increases. Walk in the park and are coming together with the geezer back in the field. And the geezer has been relegated to the back and has dropped the bridle for a few strokes. Rides. So early on, Almighty has come through to dispute the running with Hattan as they continue to climb uphill towards the highest point of the course. Motivator poised on the outside with Gypsy King, Dubawi in fifth against the fence, racing a little keenly on the inside of Grand Central, and Oratorio the pink colours out wide. Then towards the inside comes King's Key, towards the outer at this stage is unfurled with Kong, then towards the inside King's Key is now tracked by Walk in the Park, Fracar is quite well back, and after that early shuffle, the Geezer still nudged along at the rear of the field. So they begin the descent down towards Tattenham Corner, and Almighty being ridden along to hold off Hattan. These two continue to dispute the lead. Motivator is poised in a perfect spot. Gypsy King behind the leaders. Kieran Fallon moves off the fence, looks over his right shoulder, and now begins to track Motivator, who improves going strongly. Dubawi yet to play his cards. Unfurled had a tough trip on the outside of Oratorio. Then comes King's Key. Well back walk in the park as Hattan leads the derby field on the turn for home. It's Hattan with Motivator poised there, going strongly. In third place is Gypsy King. Dubawi begins to edge closer. Frankie Dottori nursing him home. Then back in fifth place, unfurled not too much from the back. Hattan leads. Motivator poised. Dubawi now being ridden along. Gypsy King towards the outside. Motivator goes to the front in the derby. Takes it from Hattan. In third, in third place, Dubawi is in third. Then comes Gypsy King. Motivator stretches. The response is immediate and he stretches five lengths clear from Dubawi in second. Walk in the park is back in third but Motivator striding clear for Johnny Murtagh and Michael Bell and the 230 strong Royal Ascot Racing Club have owned a derby winner. Motivator by three in second walk in the park. Dubawi third, Frakar four, Gypsy King unfurled Hattan the Giza and Grand Central. First, number 10, second, number 14, third, number 2, the fourth horse was number 4. The fifth horse was number six, and the sixth horse was number seven. The full result now of this, the fifth race of the afternoon, and the 2005 running of the Vodafone Derby is first, number 10, Motivator. Second, number 14, Walk in the Park. Third, number two, Dabawe. Fourth, number four, Frakas. Fifth was number six, Gypsy King, and the sixth horse was number seven, Hattan.